Hello everyone, this is Spliced, and today I'm going to bring you another Banshee Ultra gameplay. Today I got a 36 kill streak on Stormbreak, and today I'm going to tell you about the third and final strategy for the Banshee, which is situational awareness. Situational awareness is something that a lot of people do not use and do not utilize properly. They're not really even aware of it. And what is situational awareness? Situational awareness is something that everyone in every vehicle should know about. It is knowing about your environment that you're around, the enemies that you're going up against, what they have, and how to deal with every enemy that you come across. So let's get right into it. So how do you deal with certain situations? For example, if someone is charging a Spartan laser at you and you are wide in the open with the Banshee, what will you do? You don't want to ignore it, obviously. You want to come up with a quick plan to deal with both killing the Spartan laser and making sure it does not hit you. The longer your Banshee has a high durability, the longer you will survive and more kills you will rack up uh, as time progresses. So, if someone is charging a Spartan laser at you, what I like to do is quickly do a backflip. It uh, throws their uh, their aim off guard, and they won't be able to shoot you like clearly. It gives them a not a clear shot. And if you're too in the open and you don't have any cover to go behind immediately, just keep backflipping, boosting, doing like barrel rolls, just like so they won't ever have a chance to shoot you. And uh, But if they do fire and they miss, then you can relax a little bit, you have time to look for a safe spot to go to, or uh, if you know where they are 100%, then you can immediately turn around and pull the assault on them. By doing that, it uh, throws them off their aim because now they're afraid that you're going to hit them, and they are not really calm and collective with their shot and it gives you more confidence in hitting them and gives them less of a chance of hitting you. So you can either A, go behind cover or B, uh, take him out before he has a chance to kill you. Uh, another example is the Scorpion and the reason why I mention the Spartan Laser and the Scorpion the most in these Banshee videos is because they are the two most deadly threats to the Banshee. The Scorpion is a two-shot or three-shot to the Banshee Ultra, I'm not quite sure. Uh, one shot takes away the shields, two shots, I don't know, it, it either kill, kills it or not. Anyways, um, what to do when you approach a Scorpion in the distance. If he is looking at you, immediately do a backflip or do a barrel roll, turn around, do not face him. Uh, do not fight him because he will be ready to fire at you and shooting a Banshee down uh, even while backflipping is uh, very easy. All you have to do is wait for their the end of their backflip cycle, and they're, they'll be at a standstill position, easy to shoot at. So what you want to do is make sure that you get away from it as fast as possible, um, and typically you would want to stay away from that area where the scorpion is because he will be looking in the sky where you are and he will be waiting for you but if a distraction comes along like an enemy starts shooting at him or tries to board the scorpion he will obviously turn his turret away so you want to give it just a few seconds just like 10 or 15 seconds then go back to the area see if he's still looking at you probably won't be then you can start like multiply multiple uh, attacks on the scorpion um, uh, a good strategy to use when you're attacking the scorpion is to look on your radar when fighting him because you want to be right above the scorpion if you're right above he cannot look up and shoot you he will be powerless to hit you all he can do is drive backwards or forwards just make sure that he's within the small circle on your radar if you notice the um, slightly more uh, solid uh, circle around your character make sure that the scorpion remains inside there and you can keep hit hitting him without him hitting you that's a great way of dealing with scorpions another way is to just keep your distance and fire at him here and there just make sure that uh, he's not looking at you and trying to kill you so situational awareness in general though is knowing what every Spartan soldier has that you know about. So, every Spartan soldier that you have seen on the map, 
just make sure that they don't have a power weapon that can compete with you or threaten you. If they don't, then you don't have to worry about them, even if they're shooting you with a battle rifle. Just make sure that they don't shoot you too much or else you'll start losing durability. Um, but you got to have a good eye towards these uh, enemies because if they have a power weapon, you got to be able to spot that immediately so then you can make a quick decision to deal with it. Um, so those are the two examples and that is the general situational awareness that you must know about. Um, going against other vehicles such as banshees and uh, wraiths and stuff, just make sure that you are prioritizing the most deadly threats first and then go after the other things. Um, if you're going against another banshee, uh, it is quite obviously you want to prioritize that because he's going to stay on you no matter what. Uh, you want to make sure you take you win the fight take him out and uh, then focus on anyone else who may be trying to take you down so That's uh, that's pretty much the strategy for situational awareness Hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video, and I will see you later
We've taken out the enemy core. <laughs> <laughs> 